other outfit. I mean, we have um, there was some. What well, does that <laughs> look like though in practice? Well, you know, give me some tangible examples here of the staff dress code. Of um, the things, uh, yeah, shirt and tie, um, a suit, tailored trousers, um, a jacket. If you're walking around corridors, jacket removed. Um, if you're in the classroom. Um, that type of thing, something that looks um, business-like for um, those that want to dress in female attire, you know, that type of thing. So when you say jacket, so jacket in the corridor and then removed in the classroom? Yeah, um, you, you might want to, you might be more animated in the classroom, you might, uh, it might be warmer in the classroom. Um, so it allows teachers to feel a little bit more comfortable. But um, in the corridors, we ask children to wear blazers. Um, so it's important to be consistent. Got you. So, as for, so imagine I'm a member of staff. If I sort of was wearing, if I didn't have a blazer on in the corridor, and then had a blazer on in the classroom, would would you speak to me about that? Yeah, because the children would pick the staff member up. You have to remember that children um, really have a strong sense of fairness, um, and there's this sort of myth that sort of I might be, or people in my position might be, these characters that just um, uh, it just sort of make diktats from an office quite a long way away from the action. If I'm walking down the corridor and a staff member isn't wearing their jacket, then a, 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 a student's probably going to take me aside and say, he's not wearing his jacket. What are you going to do about it? So it's it's um, a self-policing system. Now, that's not to say that there can't be different rules for adults from um, children, uh, but it is to say that there is an innate sense of fairness. And if there is a difference, then you need to explain why that difference is. Um, because you want, I want to give the sense that we're all one team. You know, this isn't uh, Mr. Scales and his school. This is one team of staff and 